Hello and welcome. Today we travel to South Africa, a land of contrast. On one hand, it boasts stunning natural beauty, a vibrant culture, and a rich history. On the other hand, it has a dark side, one that is rooted in centuries of inequality and oppression. South Africa's economy has been experiencing significant growth in recent years, with a gross domestic product growth rate of 3.1% in 2021. It is one of the most industrialized nations in Africa, with a well-developed infrastructure and a vibrant private sector. With a thriving business environment, South Africa has become the economic powerhouse of the African continent. South Africa has a lot to offer to tourists and investors alike. It is home to some of the world's most beautiful natural wonders, including Table Mountain, Kruger National Park, and the Cape of Good Hope. With a robust tourism industry, South Africa has become a favorite destination for many international tourists, contributing significantly to the economy. South Africa dark side entails the witnessing of apartheid, the system of institutionalized racial segregation that lasted for nearly five decades, leaving deep scars on South African society. Its legacy is still evident today, more than 25 years after the end of the system. Despite the end of apartheid, many South Africans are still struggling to make ends meet. Poverty, unemployment, and inequality remain widespread, particularly among black South Africans. At the same time, there is a small but wealthy elite that enjoys a lifestyle that is worlds apart from the struggles of the majority. The issue of inequality in South Africa is deeply intertwined with the country's history. The legacy of apartheid, coupled with other factors such as globalization and technological change, has led to a situation where a small minority enjoys a disproportionate share of the country's wealth. In many parts of the country, the living conditions are dire. Millions of South Africans live in townships and informal settlements, without access to basic services like electricity, running water, or sanitation. Poverty and unemployment remain persistent problems in the country, with over 29% of the population living below the poverty line. Additionally, crime and violence are still rampant, particularly in urban areas, making South Africa one of the most dangerous countries in the world. The country also faces a significant challenge in dealing with the HIV AIDS epidemic, with an estimated 7.7 .7 million people living with the virus. Some South Africans are frustrated over the lack of progress in addressing these issues have boiled over into protests and sometimes violent clashes with police. South Africa is a country of contrasts, but it is also a country of resilience and hope. With a renewed commitment to justice and equality, its people can build a better future for all. Thanks for viewing. Hello 